Hello guys, welcome back to a, another episode of Skyrim. As you can see, we are uh, right where we left off. Up here, whoa, how'd that happen? Okay, come on. Weird. Strange things are happening. Anyways, um, we're back up here, but that's not where we really need to be. So we are going to go back down to the Shrouthard Barrow because... Uh, as you guys may recall, last episode, or maybe two episodes ago, we had gotten the, um, we had gotten the Sapphire Dragon Claw, and that is a, an item that will allow us to go deep inside of this, uh, secret passageway and find, hopefully, whatever awesome treasures down here. And I figured this would be a nice little side quest to do, um... You know, a, a, probably a pretty, pretty appropriate uh, little quest for us. So, let's go down here and see what we can find. First thing we have to do is, of course, pull all these stupid levers. And if I recall correctly, it was this one and this one. Sweet. Looks like my memory uh, is serving me well. <laughs> I. Uh, Okay, so yeah, I think this way is how we get to where the Sapphire Claw is. Now we just need to look in our inventory. Um, it's probably miscellaneous. Maybe it's keys. Oh. Um, hmm. Let's just go to all. Hmm. Okay, here it is. So I see, um... <laughs> okay, I believe it looks like there is a moth, an owl, and then a bear. Okay, moth, owl, bear. So let's see if we can't do that. So this should be moth, owl, and bear. Does it work? Yes, sweet. Okay. Stand back and let's see what happens. Hopefully there's not too much in here. Um, we've gotten past the wait, Petty Soul Gym. Uh, hide helmets. Those are valuable. I think I'm going to try to to buy lots of little things, to carry lots of these little things that are um, very light. Hmm. It's fairly valuable. Okay. Let's see what we have in here. So that's nothing. This looks very ominous. Okay. Oh gosh. Oh, I already have this. Hopefully that's not the treasure of this whole place. That'd be really... Oh, that's lame. Let's see what these guys have. Amethyst, bone meal, gold. And that's nothing. Um, some arrows and gold. Oh. You okay, Lydia? Oh well. Her health is pretty low. What the hell? I swear, that guy was using magic. I didn't know these guys could use magic even. You okay, Lydia? I'm right behind you. Let's okay. Keep going then. Interesting. So it was like a ice mage, draugr thing. What's well, down that way? Hmm. I could have sworn there was. I don't know what triggered all of that. Maybe it was me taking that book up or. 
something like that, but I want to go that way. But I guess we have to go this way. Oh, okay. Anything else in here? Nope. Alright, well then, we'll just keep on keeping on. And... Oh, oh god. Help me. I'm dying, wow. What? Oh, you okay, Lydia? I've got your back. Let's get going then. All right, let me a uh, quick save real quick. Because... Oh boy. Now that was an actual skeleton. Where is my healing? Alright, there we go. Pull back out our trusty axe. That doesn't sound so great. These embalming tools are kind of creepy. You okay, Lydia? You're uh, emitting some sort of foul green cloud of stench. You okay? I guess she's okay. Some ruined books, some embalming tools, some more ruined books. Lots of ruined books. Okay. And some more gold. Nice, guys. Nice. So let's see. Okay, Lydia? Lydia? You alive? Okay. She's alive. Well, how do we get down and hold up? Lydia, you're, you're in my way. Hmm. Well, let's... Let's look up here real quick. <laughs> She's not having such great luck with all those traps. Now this... Oh gosh. Now oh, we're gonna... Okay. So this is a, a tough lock to... This is a tough lock to pick. But if we can do it, and I don't know if you guys hear that, but that's my, my dog freaking out. Okay, I don't want to use all of my locks. Okay, so it's, th it's somewhere in this quadrant. Uh, it's so annoying when he barks. Well, we're just... Just tearing through lock picks. I don't, I don't know if it's even possible for me to unlock this one. Oh. Oh my gosh! Look how close we were. 
Okay, we guys, guys, I, I know we're just tearing through some lockpicks, but we can do it. Oh, come on, it's so close. So it's not quite far enough, I guess. Ah! <laughs> you guys, you see this? The heck? We've just broken like 12 of these. Yes! We got it. And we leveled up our lock picking skills. Picks though. Oh man. We have three left. This is never going to work. This is our last one, guys. Man. Well. Oh, we leveled up. Um, whatever. We'll just remember that that's there. And, um, we'll go with stamina first. Let's see if there's any lockpicking thing we can upgrade. Interesting. Well, lock picking isn't so great, so let's go back to um Do we have anything else with either heavy armor or two handed? Maybe two handed? Two handed, let's do that. Oh man, we're not quite high enough to do that. We're not also, we also don't have that yet either. I'm not big on blocking. Let's go back to the heavy armor. Um. Alright. Our armor rating is even higher. Well, I, guys, I'm not seeming to be able to open that chest right now. Um, I'm also out of lock picks. I don't know, it might have been stupid for me to use all of them up like that, but... Oh well, we'll find more. We can always buy more. They're cheap. Um, and we have way more than we'll ever need. Um, okay. Let's see what these guys have. A bunch of arrows. And some bone meal. All right. Is that all that's left of him? All right, let's continue. Which way do we go? That's where he came in from. And this guy, yep. All righty. Well, that didn't work so well. Let's see what he had to, uh, to offer. Any more of these guys around here?
I guess he's in the other room. Oh. Let's, uh... Let's take this guy on. Oh, wow. That's easy enough. Let's see what this guy had to offer. Some arrows and an axe. That's about it. That's a... Totally called that. Oh, nice. A steel ingot. Well, these guys are easy enough to kill if they, uh... If you pay close attention, you'll see them where they are. And they won't. And they won't chase you till they kill you. All right, that was easy enough. Oh, hey. I wonder if that key... I bet that key we can use to open up that one... That door had locked... Oh, that door had locked us in there, okay. Now I believe... Hopefully this, this key will unlock that treasure chest too. Maybe, maybe not, but at, at the very least, that'll be a, a good thing for us to learn. Man. It's super lame. Okay. So, the key, we actually need actual lockpits to be able to open that. Oh god. Well, that was not so great, was it? And I apologize, I don't know if you guys can hear that, but my dog is barking in the other room. Actually, here, I'm going to pause real quick, I'll be right back. Alright guys, I am back. Sorry about that, I put my dog in the other room so you guys wouldn't be able to hear him on the... Uh, on the recording. He's still probably barking. He does that a lot. What's down here? Anything? Anything interesting? Nope, nothing. Alrighty. Let's take a look over here. Oh yeah, one of these soul gems. Okay. interesting. Oh. Poor Lydia's caught in a battle of some sorts. There we go. Mission accomplished. I don't know how this got open. But we got some coins. Nah. And some gold. Nice. Oops, almost forgot the gold. Don't want to do that. Let's 
kind of crazy. So the one on the end is a whale. And this one's a bird. What else do we have here? This is a, another whale. Okay. So this one's a snake. Sweet. Mission accomplished. What's this? Uh, some sort of throne there. Sweet. Oh. You okay, Lydia? He almost just died there. Large, <laughs> largely due to my fault. Um, and some rocks just dropped down there too. This place is not safe. It's really not safe. Is your health back to full yet? I'm not going to go progress forward until... Oh man, I'm out of lockpicks. Okay. That's a problem. Right, why is she saying oof? Why are you saying oof? Do I have a rock fall on you? A little magic potion. Another burl urn. I think we can buy some more lock picks though. Gotta remember that we missed that uh, that one door there for the future. Oh god. I'm gonna quick save. Got a bad feeling about this. Yes, yeah, uh, yeah, I do too. Get some magic out here. All right, let's pull out my axe. There. Is Lydia okay? You okay? Okay, I'm gonna grab that. And let's search these guys for all the awesome valuable things they probably have. Before I continue up that way, I'm gonna go back and take a look at all 
of these guys. They probably have some at least minorly cool things. Be careful, Lydia, though. You're gonna be, she might end up knocking me off the side. Don't want that. Okay. I'm interested to see what's down there, too. I don't think these skeletons probably don't have much with them that's anything too valuable. Some embalming tools. You know. Typical. Typical things, really. Now that, that's a cool sword. But... Bone meal. Nothing. Managed to really avoid some damage by killing them while they were inside of their... While they were inside of everything, you know? Now, is there a way up to this one? Okay, there is. I was going to say, there's no way up here. Then, uh, oh, well, looks like the skeleton's gone, just his bow is left. Oh, there he is, okay. And finally, I want to look around here in the back, see if there are any exits or anything cool. You never know, they, they always like to hide these kind of things in video games. I would have really expected this place right back here where we're standing right now to be the kind of place where they would hide something secret, you know? Come on, Bethesda. You guys know, you guys have played enough Lord of, uh, I mean, uh, Legend of Zelda games to know that you have to hide stuff down there at those secret places. Come on, guys. You can do better than that. Anyways, though, I assume that we're going to find, like, a, um, an item of power or something like that in here. A ward of power. Something like that. We killed the overlord of the barrow. Oh gosh. Oh wow. Yes. Hey, yeah. Uh. Okay. Well, Oh, there is that one door we could go back and lockpick. Um, yeah, let's let's go use one, well, one or two of our picks on that. That's a little ways back, but we 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 can do it. I'm I'm really happy though with our. Conquest of this place, though. I think we found some cool stuff. I think that was pretty, um... Oh. Maybe this is the... the maybe this is just a one-way exit. So let's let's not go backwards. In fact, because we'll, we, we have that one door and the chest to do, anyways. Um... You know, so we might as well just go all the way back here and see if there's anything else hidden back here. Um... Because I don't think there's a secret exit here like there was at the old place, so... Think. Sweet, we're gonna learn a word. We learned kind for kind's peace. Let's, uh... Huh? Interesting. Is that it? Or is there an exit here? Oh, this might be that one room that we saw earlier that had the treasure chest in it, you know, in the fire. Let's see if it is. Maybe. Maybe not. 
There's a fire over here. We can sit down. Let's just take a little rest. Do you see this? Um, I think the game is broken, guys. <laughs> For the record. Okay. Yep. So maybe this is a secret exit. Sure looks like a crazy secret tunnel. And some gold. Are we where I think we are? Aha! Indeed we are. So now we just have to get out of here. And also we have to keep in mind the Oh, oh, wrong. That's not right. That's not right. That's not No, no, Lydia, no. I swear. And we're out. So we managed to get down into the barrow and uh, successfully beat that level. And so I think what we're going to do is um, go on into town and. Uh, yeah, we're going to go on into town and um, see if we can't sell some of this stuff at the end. So actually, you know what, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to call it episode right here, since we've beat the entire barrow, or whatever it's called, and when, when you guys get back, I will have sold anything that we don't need, and we'll continue on our next adventure, alright guys? So thanks, I'll be right back. Later.